Hey, Kevin. Hey, Keenan. Good afternoon. It feels great outside right now. It's dry. We're warming up a little bit. Upper 30s this afternoon, and as you just saw over Southfield, the sun is out. We just have kind of a thin layer of clouds overhead. It's a little breezy today, and this afternoon, winds have been around 15 up to 20 miles per hour sustained out of the southwest. We've had some gusts that have been uh, over 20 miles per hour, though, so a little breezy this afternoon, but we'll take it. It's dry, it's mild, it's going to stay that way through the day tomorrow. And how about this? Less than 30 days away from spring. Who's counting, though? 28 days away from spring. Temperatures will be near 40 degrees again tomorrow. So highs today near 40, partly cloudy and times mostly sunny. A little breezy this afternoon, but the winds get lighter tonight. It will get colder tonight with lows around 20 degrees. And then tomorrow, light winds 39 for the high temperature. Should be a pleasant day tomorrow. Once we get to Saturday, though, Everything starts to change by Saturday and Sunday. We need to plan for wet weather Saturday. There could be some light rain or drizzle early on in the morning. And because temperatures are going to start in the 20 Saturday morning, we'll also keep an eye on potentially a few areas of some patchy ice. Most of the rain Saturday is going to arrive late in the day, and that's when we'll really warm up. So primarily rain showers Saturday afternoon through Saturday evening. The rain could get heavier. There could even be a few rumbles of thunder, a few thunderstorms late Saturday evening into Saturday night. Temperatures will be in the 40s though. A high of 46 Saturday despite starting out below freezing. We warm up late day heavier rain and a few thunderstorms possible. And then Saturday night temperatures stay in the mid 40s. So our Sunday temperatures the low in the 40s in the morning and the high temperature is going to be in the 40s, but temperatures fall likely through the day and it's also going to get very windy on Sunday. We're going to continue the future cast after 11 PM Saturday. At this point, widespread rain and once the cold air moves in and the winds pick up Sunday morning, this rain could change to snow showers briefly before it moves out. The main focus for Sunday will be the strong wind gusts because that could be strong enough to cause even a few power outages. Wind gusts could be over 40 miles per hour Sunday, and again, the rain could change over to snow. And right now, it doesn't look like accumulating snow. We'll get a better picture as we get a little closer, but just know that it'll change over to snow before we dry out Sunday afternoon, and temperatures falling from the 40s in the morning through the 30s in the afternoon. And by Monday morning, we're below freezing. Monday, lighter winds, and we'll have high temperatures next week, back to near average around the mid-30s. You're watching 7 Action News. We'll be right back.